lot of people have asked me what body fat percentage will get me the most attraction? What will get me the most attention when I'm walking on the street, when I'm in this space? What will get girls actually wanting me? What body fat percentage will do that? I'm gonna give you two different answers really because there's an answer where you can actually stick around year round that actually has real benefits and real results. And there's a more extreme answer that will probably get you more results. The first answer I'm gonna tell you lot is if you get to 10% body fat and around there, you're gonna be a lot more leaner, your face is gonna look a lot more sharper, you're gonna look a lot more better in a sense. You're not gonna be as big, let's say, but you're gonna look a lot more leaner, sharper, your face is gonna be sharper, your features are gonna come out a bit more. That is kind of good for attraction and all this stuff, and I've been around that level before, and I've got quite a lot of attraction with it, but it didn't really compare to this past year where I actually bulked up quite a bit I bought up from 170 to around 193 pounds and I cut down to 180 and I bought up back to like 185 and right now I'm around the 190s mark. This has made a massive difference, this 15 to 20 pounds in regards to attraction and even recently especially, I've had a lot more attraction and I'm nowhere near as lean as that body fat percentage, which is an insane difference when you think about it. I'm not 10% body fat, I'm not that lean, I'm not that ripped. I've still got ab definition to get me wrong and I'm still not a fat fuck, but I am able to get more attraction at this weight. And the thing is, a lot of guys want to chase that physique where you're lean, you're ripped. The thing is with that, it's just calorie restriction that gets you to that result. Cause I've done it before where I've weighed 170, been ripped, veins in my abs and all this, and it worked. 100% it worked, I got a bit of attraction or whatever, but it didn't really fulfill me truly and I still felt small I still felt like I need to be stronger I need more muscle I need all this stuff that's how I still felt but this past year has made the biggest difference in regards to this with me where I've weighed more whilst being fairly lean obviously I'm not fat I've got definition and I've stayed probably between I'd say 12 and 15 percent body fat range and this has made a true difference for me I would say 14 percent and under is probably where you start seeing differences of course, the lower your body fat percentage gets, the better. This has made a big difference for me and on how my life has been essentially and also with what I can maintain because I can maintain this with a lot more ease than let's say trying to stick around 10% body fat at weighing 170 because that's going to take it out of me and that's going to hurt me and that's going to make me frustrated every time because I'm going to be so skinny and I'm going to be restricted to my calories. For me to stay at this weight around the 190s, I can still eat quite a lot of food still eat quite a bit of food and feel good in myself and still look decent still have definition still look strong still get stronger in the gym better lifts and that's the true balance that you want and a lot of people put it on this external factor of attracting women and attracting all this and the thing is when you're more ripped you will get more attention in a sense from a certain type of girl you will get more attention but when you're a bit more jacked and you've got a bit more muscle you get attention from all different types of girls so i found the younger girls like it when you're more ripped let's say that 18 to like 21 range, let's say like that, they like it a bit more. But when you're a bit more jacked with a bit more muscle, you get girls of all ages, like all ages. I'm talking from like 18 to whatever age you want, 50s or whatever, whatever you're into, I know some of you will be into that. And it's one of these things that truly makes the difference in every area. You're bigger, you're stronger, you look more presentable. And instead of you being skinny and ripped, and people only know that when you take your top off. Now you're actually looking physically strong, looking stronger and looking better. And that's a true thing, man. And that helps you in every area, whether that's in a life sense, a social gathering, whether that's in a job sense, whether that's in an interview sense, whether that's in just a making money sense, you know, more presentable people respect you more because the muscle you've got. You've got to understand that this makes a true difference. And I would argue that's a lot better, building some muscle and then being at a 45 percentage that is healthy that's maintainable long term. You will get a lot of attraction, but you still have to apply yourself, of course, with these women and whatever. And a lot of people think you get in shape and then it just all comes to you. It doesn't. It doesn't at all. And especially from my life, I know that it doesn't. What you still have to do is you still have to interact with these women. You still have to talk to them. Of course, you may have times where they come up to you, talk to you, interact with you. And they usually are more on the sluttier side, let's say. More time they are when they come up to you and talk to you more time especially if it's on a sexual thing saying you're fit or whatever because I've had that a few times and a lot of times they turn out to be a bit high body count or whatever which is fine if you want to do stuff with them of course you don't really want a relationship with them but that's fine if you want to do stuff with them but when you are in shape you will have a lot more 
girls looking at you, being more attracted to you, giving you eyes or whatever. It's up to you to develop your personality enough, to build that confidence up enough to go up and talk to that person, talk to that girl, talk to her, make her laugh, make her smile. And once you got them things in place, in reality, you're in a really good position. You could more than likely get her out on a date with these if you just go up, talk to her, make her laugh, make her smile, get her to do stuff with you. That's what I found when they're attracted to you because you're in shape. You don't have to be crazily in shape. You go up, you talk to her and you make her laugh, make her smile. You're able to lead these interactions and say, oh, we're going to go out and do this. Would you be up for it? And they say, yeah, you're going to be in an amazing position. You're going to be in an incredible position. And this is what I've understood has made the biggest difference. It isn't the actual body in it of itself. It gets the attraction, the love and all that stuff externally. But then you still have to act on that and show your personality properly and in a way go and make a laugh, make a smile, all this. You still have to do that, of course. Of course you do. But it does help a lot. And I'm not going to lie, it does help a lot. When you're in shape, the options go up an insane amount. And I would say to you lot, more than likely, it'd be best for you to bulk. Do a bulk over time, especially like winter season now. I don't know if I'm bulking again now because I'm struggling to eat that much food, especially with how active I am. But I'm around a good range. 190 is decent from my height and all this stuff. But I say to you, lot, bulk a bit up. Build a bit of muscle, build a bit of strength, and you're going to be in an amazing position there. Then lean down, make sure you're putting on lean muscle, of course, over time. Do it slowly, do, do it quick. Make sure it's quite a clean bulk as well. Make sure it's quite a clean bulk. Of course, you need a little bit of shit here or there, but make sure it's a clean bulk and it's steady and steady and steady. And of course, you're watching your protein as well, and you will be able to put on some lean muscle. And this is what I've understood. It's made a big difference in that sense. When you're around this range where you want muscle and you're fairly lean, that's when the attraction gets up to the next level and that's what i've understood this year but of course you will put the areas in in yourself as well hope you log a lot of value if you want to achieve a physique that you're proud of grateful of happy of shoot me an email at reallouis23 at gmail.com i can make you achieve a physique that you're truly proud of thank you